Hey, it's Nicole Mitchell, and today I'm actually going to leave you with a Friday Freedom speech or message. I want to encourage you and lift you up and set you free from any limiting beliefs or fears you have. You are exactly what this world needs. Your wiring, your personality, your passion, your habits, your hobbies, your joy, your love, your excessiveness, your abundance, your vision, your goals, your passion, everything about you is exactly what this world needs. Sure, you might be too much for some people, you might not be enough for others, but you are exactly enough. You are more than enough. You are so enough that it blows your mind. So today, choose to stand in that truth. Choose to stand in your power that you are exactly what this world needs. And those dreams and desires you carry within you are not, are not crazy. They're not absurd and they're not selfish. Those desires and dreams are given to you so you can live those out during your lifetime. And so I want to I wanna encourage you to rise up and say, this is who I am. This is the vision I have. This is the passion I bring to the table. These are the gifts that I have. This is how my life, my joy, my love, my work, my calling is going to bless and change and heal this world. When I rise up, I help others rise up with me. I live in a world and in a universe where I win and others win. And when others win, I win because we're all connected. And there is no place where I end and you begin or where you end and I begin. We're all one. So when I rise up, we're all rising up together. When I love on myself, I'm loving on the world. And the flip side is true. When I'm talking negatively to myself, when I'm dragging myself down, I'm dragging down the rest of the world. So it is of utmost importance that you own the fullness of who you are. The universe chose you, chose to embody you with her strength and her brilliance and her creativity so you could be the most powerful creature that has ever walked the planet. It's not an imposter right to rise up. It's an imposter to play small. It's an imposter to pretend that you're anything but great and brilliant and beautiful and talented and called. You have work to do in the world. You have things to accomplish. You have things to achieve. We're not gonna let people, people's ideas or opinions stop you, are you? We're not gonna let the fear of others become our fear, right? We're not gonna let other people's limiting beliefs become our limiting beliefs. We have this divine appointment to be who we're meant to be, to do what we're called to do, and to do it in this lifetime. Do not be like so many of the dying who have the regret at the end of their life that they wish, they wish they could go back and pursue the dream and calling. Uh-uh, we're not. that's not gonna be us at the end of our life, we're gonna look back and say, oh my God, I'm so glad I did it. I'm so glad I took that risk. I'm so glad I took that step of faith. I'm so glad I embodied the fullness of who I was. I'm so glad I pursued my dreams with everything I got because look what has happened. Look how beautiful and happy and fulfilled my life is. I'm so glad I went after it. Let that be the story at the end of your life. May you be joyful about who you are. May you be grateful for who you are. Embody yourself for who you are because the whole world benefits. You are exactly what this world needs. Own it, proclaim it, live it, embody it, and celebrate it with us and the world because when you rise, we rise. Love you guys.